There will never be another Thanksgiving the same. Grieving father Todd Blitzstein relives the painful moments. The 4.30 knock on the door from police Thanksgiving morning delivering the news about Peyton. I said, is he all right? And he said, no. And that's what I asked him. He said, yeah, he's gone. Gone at 17 years old. His father didn't say whether Peyton was armed or why he might have fired at a stranger the night before Thanksgiving outside of a house in Aurora. He did tell us the teens were dropping off one of their friends and that Peyton was just a kid who loved sharing mozzarella sticks with his dad. He loved spending time with his older brother. His grandma was his world. The biggest thing was is when it came to grandma and Peyton time, he loved staying home and watching. Hallmark Channel and Murder She Wrote. Now this father forcing himself to watch the first seconds of this ring footage, <laughs> capturing what's believed to be an argument with Alan Holland, a former Greenwood Village police officer, over careless driving. I didn't want to see my boy hit fall on the ground. I didn't want to see. I didn't want to hear the sound. Stopping it before the bullets, Blitzstein says he saw enough to know answers and action are needed. Don't know what happened that night. Don't know why things went down the way they did. But I know with what I've seen, they didn't have to. I want the situation to be handled to the fullest extent.